Christmas and happy holidays guys welcome back to my channel today I'm coming at you for my PJs and I'm going to be doing a what I got for Christmas video these videos are my all-time favorites I've been doing them for many years so if you want to watch the old ones for some reason the links will be down below oh my gosh I got a new lens and I like don't really know how to work it but I hope you guys can tell a difference but yeah I guess that's the first thing I got for Christmas uh, my parents got this for me the other thing that I'm using that I got for Christmas is this ring light my brother Jack got it for me and apparently you can like put it on your desk and people use it during zoom but I'm currently using it in my videos and it's about as tall as my camera which I would say is about five feet tall or so and then lastly the last thing that I'm like wearing or using right now is this PJ set it actually came in this little box I kept the box for you guys it's from Target my mom got these for me and it's just a shirt and sh you can't even see the shorts and shorts here and then it also came with what is it a sleep mask oh here it is it also came with this cute little sleep mask here if you guys watch my night routine or a couple other of my videos I sleep with a sleep mask now Liv really put me onto that but I can't sleep with that one now if you guys are new subscribe down below I've been making videos every Monday Wednesday and Friday which has just been frankly exhausting I'm probably gonna go back to once a week starting in January I think I'm probably gonna take the week off just because I am touch burnt out I'm excited to just kind of have a break and reset and recharge and get ready for the new year i have so many awesome videos for you guys and i just want to take a moment to like thank you guys so much for watching my videos this year supporting me commenting on my videos subscribing watching them anything it's so appreciated and i just love doing this and it's a great little thing i got going here and it just makes me really happy that we've kind of built a community and just another thing before we get into this this year as awful as it has been there's been a lot of great things that have happened too and it's really made me appreciate appreciate those great things but also it makes me realize what I have right in front of me which is my family and just take the time during this holiday season and in general but also like really during this time to just like appreciate your family that you have here with you um, either in your immediate household or in general grandparents oh <laughs> we're not crying on the internet all that to say just cherish those who are with you now and you never know what could happen. So, hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get into it. Usually I organize these things. I'm just grabbing things that are in front of me. The first things that I see are these AirPod Pros, which I am so excited for. I tried them yesterday actually, so they're not even in this box anymore. I have AirPods and I've had them since the beginning of first year. I bought them for myself. I don't think I knew how much I was gonna use them in college. I use them, first of all, every single day, but I use them like many, many, many times a day. My old ones are definitely a little bit run down. They to charge for like an hour tops like I would have to like switch them out during class and like charge them these are gonna get so much use also like the sound canceling noise canceling thing so cool okay next thing that I'm seeing sitting right here it's this massive fluffy blanket from Target I'm so excited about this this is in the full queen size I just I've been freezing in this house ever since I've been home our like heat AC it's definitely old so like we need to get a new one but also I think like I try to keep my door open as much as possible but I really don't think the heater works in my room so I am freezing all the time and I have determined I need to sleep with a blanket underneath my like duvet so this is perfect and also just like next year I know I'll be needing like a bunch of blankets and stuff for when friends come over or like just to have so I'm so excited about this it's gonna go to a lot of good use if you know you know I am obsessed with puzzles and have been ever since kind of quarantine started but we only have a couple here in my house so <laughs> My mom went crazy and got me four. I think they're all a thousand piece and three of them are from White Mountain Puzzles, which in my opinion is the best. This first one is of Boston. My dad's whole side of the family is from Boston and we're big Patriots fans, Red Sox, Celtics, you name it, Boston people, yes. So I'm excited about this. It has like Manio Hall, which we've been a couple times and like just stuff like that. So I love this. Also my favorite puzzle of all time is from White Mountain, it's of Cape Cod. So like that's also like really cool like Massachusetts vibes I love this one is best places in America I just love to look at the little pieces so I'm excited about that one and then this one like I said is DC I haven't been to DC in a long time we used to go I'm from Virginia if you guys didn't know and we used to go there on like field trips and stuff and then last one I thought was very just I don't know timely I like this one this is Rose of the Riveter we can do it this is also a thousand pieces so I'm so excited about all these I'm definitely starting one tonight I don't know which one but I'm starting one tonight I'm 
I'm so excited. Okay, so for some loungewear, I just see it all sitting here. First of all, like I said, I got this PJ set. I'm so excited about this. I slept in it last night. Oh, so comfortable. My dad also, to kind of cure the like, I'm freezing all the time thing, he got me these wool socks from Duluth Trading. He said that they're really great because they're like really warm, but also they're not itchy because wool is known to like be itchy. But I guess this is like some special wool. I don't know. I think this is just like so thoughtful. So I'm excited to wear these. I should actually put them on right now because I'm freezing. And then a couple other things. These are both from Target. I think I mentioned this maybe in one of my favorites videos, but these bras from Target, so comfortable. They're from True & Co. And this is called True Everybody. Everybody. And it's just like a scoop neck bra. It doesn't have an underwire. I just love this because I wear sports bras most of the time and I feel like this is like a more mature version of that <laughs> Oh, and then these pants they're also from Target I am so excited about these because they have this little thing But they're these gray lounge pants and they're basically like the other ones I already have but the ones I have one are too short and two have Approximately ten holes in them like they're so beat down raggedy because I wear them all the time So I am so excited about these she just she just knew I, I needed these speaking of like loungewear activewear I am Oh, excited about these. These are the Splits 59 Raquel Flare Leggings, AKA Yoga Pants. I've been wanting these forever. I tried them on yesterday and they are the perfect length on me. I'm also 5'8 with like really long legs. So I am shocked that these are like a normal length on me, let alone even a little bit long, dare I say. But I'm gonna be wearing these with platforms, so they'll totally be fine. But I'm so excited about these. Speaking of my mom, just like, knowing me. One of these she gave to me on Christmas, but if you guys know, you know. This year I've been a candle freak, and I don't know if it's quarantine. It's, I mean, it's 100% quarantine. That's like how it started. So the one she gave to me on Christmas Eve is this. It's Sand and Fog Fraser Fur. Sand and Fog is probably what I'd say is my favorite candle company. She got me another one from them. This is Teakwood, and oh my god. Wow. It smells divine. Like, just next level. You know it's a manly candle when even my brothers would consider putting it in their room. If you guys watch my favorites video, from the beginning of Vlogmas, you know Leather Oak is also one of my favorite candles. This is from Target and it just smells from like friends and family gifts, Ashley and I exchange gifts every single year. She got me this super cute little frame and she got this done from someone on Etsy, I think. She literally ordered it in November. And when did I get her gift? Like December 23rd. So that's the difference between her and I. <laughs> this is literally so cute. First of all, she's holding white, I'm holding red. Her person literally looks like her, which I think is funny. I think I'm actually gonna put this in that gray frame I have back at school that sits on my dresser. There's a picture of her and I in there now, but this is like the perfect size to fit so I'm really excited about this super thoughtful gift and then for my brother Connor he got these for me which I actually asked him to get for me he's like super into like tech computers he's got this whole setup out there like I don't even know what's going on he got me these LED lights because I was like I really want some for like around my bed apparently you can control it from your phone or the remote I don't know he's gonna help me set it up for sure Ooh. okay so I mentioned before I got the lens that's on this camera right now which I'm still trying to to figure out how to work but it's the canon efs 24 millimeter f 2.8 and my dad also got me the sandisk extreme pro 64 gigabyte sd card this is great one because i'm missing my third sd card i have no idea where it is two all my sd cards are 32 gigs and the fact that this is 64 is amazing so that i can just like keep filming all the time okay a couple little stocking stuffers she got me more of the everything but the bagel seasoning from trader joe's i mean you'd have to be living under your to not try this but I finally caved and tried it like last year so good oh she got me this cute little bath bomb it's called f bomb I don't know where it's from I've never seen like da bomb LLC I've never heard of them definitely going to be using it this week when I'm like doing some self-care things oh and then she also got me two of these clarifying shampoos these are from Redken and Ashley from Ulta if you know you know she's my hairstylist in Charlottesville I absolutely love her she used this on me before when she used this my hair was so soft and just felt super clean so I'm excited to use these and then these two things I actually forgot about but I picked out myself at Trader Joe's and she's like 
like I'm just gonna put these in your stocking. This is the Trader Joe's Hyaluronic Moisture Boost Serum. It looks like this. I guess you just like put this on. You put this on before you moisturize and right after you wash your face. And then this is a facial scrub. It's the Blueberry and Acai Facial Scrub and I guess this is just like, okay, so it's kind of like similar to like a facial treatment. So it gets rid of dead skin and just like really brightens your face. So I've been kind of like upgrading my skincare lately. So I'm excited to see how these work. My parents also got me this little phone stand that you can just like put on your desk, which I think will be so helpful, especially back at school when I have my whole like, I have my whole setup there. You can also apparently put your iPad in here, which is a game changer. My parents also both got me two books. I love books for Christmas. And I think especially when they're like thoughtful and useful, awesome. This one is the four hour work week, which is so funny because I was literally thinking about this two days ago. And I was like, I really, really want to read that book. The past year I've really been working on work-life balance, although work aka school, but I really want to learn how to kind of work smarter and not harder. So that's going to be something I'm going to read about in 2021. And then this one I'm so excited about. This is New Morning Mercies. It's a daily devotional. Michelle Reed, which is, she's one of my all time favorite YouTubers. I've been watching her since fifth grade. I don't know. Like, I've been watching Michelle for a very long time, but this is her favorite devotional and she's like super religious and has done a lot of devotionals. So I trust her. I definitely want to integrate like devotionals and stuff like that back into my morning or night routine. I'm not sure which one. I'm excited to read both of these. Last two things, which I don't know why I saved them for last because I'm so excited about them. I got two pairs of shoes and I'm thrilled about these. First of all, these ones I sent the direct link to my mom because I was like, I actually like if you get me nothing else, like I actually need running shoes. So she got me the, what are they even called? These are the Brooks Adrenaline GTS 20s. And I got these in my usual size nine. And I'm actually going to exchange them for a nine and a half just because they're a touch too small. I would wear them for like walking and not working out. But if I'm running, I definitely want them to be a touch bigger. I've actually never had Brooks before. So I'm interested to see how these are when I run. But online it said that like my foot type should work for Brooks. I usually buy the Mizuno Wave Riders, but I wanted to branch out a little bit. I also haven't had a new pair of running shoes since high school, so. Now in my third year of college, my running coach would be horrified. And then my last item that I received, I'm so excited about these. These are the Vija sneakers. These are the Campo style, and I just love the way that they look. Oh my gosh, I'm dropping everything. I actually have to like lace them up, I guess. These are what they look like. Very just like classy. Literally the only types of shoes I wear are sneakers, so these are gonna get so much use. I'm thinking they'll probably replace my P448s because I have those and they are literally falling apart, which speaks to their quality. But these are supposed to be awesome and all my friends who have them say that they're so comfortable and they're just like really great quality, which I just love, love that. You know what I forgot to share is this leather jacket. Oh my gosh, this is actually kind of my birthday present, but I was super indecisive about what leather jacket I wanted. It looks like this. It is so amazing. It's like so overexposed right now, but well, you guys get the gist. It has the silver hardware. It's from Barney's Original. I've talked about wanting a leather jacket forever, but I could never find one that I actually liked. I think that's everything I have to share with you guys today. This video was fun to watch. Hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas or any holiday that you celebrate. If you haven't caught up from Vlogmas, I'll leave a link down below. And if you're new, subscribe and I'll see you guys in 2021. Bye guys.